My name is Shahid Guyton. I'm one of the contributors here at Broad Street Ministry. Think of Broad Street Ministry as a beacon of hope, a place that you can come and feel like a human being. You can come here and you can be heard and you can be treated in the most hospitable way possible. So the first time I met Shahid, I remember thinking, whoa, this guy has a big personality. He just radiates this, this incredible positive energy. I'm originally from Newark, New Jersey, uh, born and raised. I grew up uh, with um, um, parents um, that was addicted to drugs and was basically into the street life. Eventually it got to the point that I was just wandering in the streets, sleeping in the hallways and stuff like that. I moved to Philadelphia in 2011 looking for uh, a way out. When I first started here, first thing came to mind was like, I wish that I, I knew of a place like this when I was homeless. Because the things that was going on here was stuff that I'd never seen in no other place. First of all, when they walk through the door, they're going to be greeted. Once they sit, they're going to be served by a wonderful volunteers. They're going to, somebody's going to fill up their water. And eventually, someone's going to serve them an entree. They're going to be bussed. Someone's going to serve them a dessert. And throughout the time, people are going to be engaging them in just conversation, just treating them with the dignity and respect that we all deserve. What I do here um, as a part of the concierge team is um, help people out with uh, basic things like I'm helping them get telephones, um, assisting with uh, filling out uh, welfare applications. As a concierge, would procure whatever you want if you went to a fancy hotel. We're trying to be that fancy services, just life-sustaining services we're going after. We've just been finding better and better ways to, to meet the guest needs. Uh, changes like having a health clinic now on site in partnership with Philadelphia Fight. We're able to do everything, that, almost everything that would happen in a primary care setting. We have referrals that come from the concierge or just guests can come in. A lot of what we try to do here is to restore hope in people. And I think Shahid, both in his personal life story and in his just overall demeanor, um, is just an incredibly hopeful person. Today, uh, my life is, is great. I'm at a place of peace right now, more than anything. To me, Shahid, is the perfect example of what Broad Street Ministry really is. To me, Broad Street Ministry is, is the spirit of support and love and care that my staff bring every day to this place. Here, I feel like I can take a break from the madness that is homelessness. And these guys here are unbelievable, above and beyond nice, like way nice. And that just makes me, it puts me in a calmer spot and it makes me feel better. It just makes me feel so much better. It's just a very rewarding feeling to have Broad Street Ministry in my life. Just to have this place to go to is so important for me. It matters, you know? This young man right here, he has um, take extra, extra time with me. I know he'd probably do with everybody else, but when I come down, we, we cool like that. So I just wrote him a thank you card to tell him how I feel about him. Thank you, God, for everything and every time you stop and talk to me, I feel blessed. It's all right, take your time. You are a special man, and I never told you, but you saved my life. Thank you for being here. Thank you for coming to work. God bless you and your family. Thank you. Well, my purpose in life is to inspire and to motivate people and to help them in their process. Like I wish someone would help me in my house. Because I'm fortunate I didn't have a Broad Street Ministry when I was going through my process. And it feels great to be a part of this organization.